a while now, and I still don't understand how we can breathe around here. You're stuck with aliens like a natural, and all you care about is that? Time to talk to you about Izanik. Yeah, why is everyone so scared to talk about him? He's our chieftain, and he ruled over the builders with an iron fist for many years. He executed everyone who dared to defy his word and created a regime of terror. God, I already want to punch him in the face so badly. waiting for you. Dad, we have terrible news. The destroyers made the bridge fall, and... Yeah, it seems like it's going to take a lot of time that I don't have. I'm sorry, warrior, but I fear that the bridge will be the least of your problems. What do you mean? Izanak wants to meet you. He's impressed by what you did for us. Dad, no! Mm, I should have expected it. I'll open the door to his chamber for you, and please be careful. Meet me outside once you've finished, and make sure that no one is following you. I know that face, and something's telling me that you're going to do something stupid, Ave. Ugh. Honored as well, mighty Izanak. To what do I owe the pleasure? Don't push your luck, Abe. This guy looks really dangerous. Your power impressed me, and your help against the destroyers was priceless. Would you consider joining my personal army? If you lend me your powers, I could make you immensely rich and powerful. You would rule at my side for all. What blasphemy! Our powers are not to share with some dirty power-craving monster. Not interested. Sorry, I'm not suited to become a puppet. Oh, what a shame. My servants told me that you came here to help a friend, right? Yes, she's somewhere near the core. Would you kindly help me with that, or are you too busy torturing your royal subjects? Great, now he knows where I'm hiding. Thanks, Dave. I'm sure that your friend isn't the real reason you came here. You want the power of the core. That's none of your business. A puny mortal from a useless planet dares to talk to me like that? Everything on Grisha belongs to me. And I will never let anyone near the core. Unless you decide to become one of my minions, of course. This conversation is over, but don't worry, big guy. I'm sure you'll find other minions. You'll pay for your arrogance with your blood, kid. Just wait and see. Okay, now that we are here... Do you mind telling me what's going on? We've been conspiring against Zanuck for a real long time, but no one is powerful or brave enough to stop him. But you, you might have a chance. We just need to help you to prepare to confront him. I don't know, Abe. It seems like they want to use you for their own purposes. Yeah, that may be true, but that guy needs to pay, that's for sure. And if I don't defeat him, I'll never reach the core. Why is he so obsessed by it anyway? Because his brother, Emlock, 
became the guardian instead of him. And now all he wants is to become strong enough to take his place. His brother is the guardian that I'm supposed to beat? Seriously? Yes, he's the most powerful being on Grigia. And thanks to all the energy we've gathered, Izana might take his place soon. What's the big deal with becoming the guardian anyway? The guardian lives in symbiosis with the core to protect it. In exchange, he has given immortality, absolute power, and wisdom. Oh, great. One good news after the other. To be honest, I don't know if I stand a chance against Izanak. I can't even think about getting near Eamlock. I acted cocky back there, but I don't know if I can make it. You want to reach the core to heal your planet through his powers. Am I right, Avril of the Human? Yes, and it seems that I will also be able to restore balance on Grisha as well. Or so Sun and Moon said. I don't know how you're supposed to do that, but I trust you, warrior. We both want Izanak down, so let us help you to become stronger. Sure. Do you have a plan? Meet us at the blacksmiths inside of the city. That's the first step. He's right. In order to defeat Imlac, you'll need to become stronger, and Izanak will be a decent proving ground for your skills, champion. Since he has proven to be a blasphemous creature, we have no objections to his demise. Listen, Ave, I know you want to help me, but... Don't worry, Mila. We'll find a way out of this mess. Like we always have. Restoring Earth is all that matters, right? Yeah. Welcome, warrior. Let me introduce Gun Gun, our finest blacksmith. He's a true master in runecrafting. This little tadpole is the one who will face Azonic? <laughs> that's interesting. Nice to meet you, Mr. To- um... Gan Gan? I talked with him, and we think he could improve your weapon by applying a mighty rune to it. Can you show it to him? Oh, yeah, sure. By all the sacred dark here, I have never seen anything like that. What a masterpiece. Yeah! We told you! Do you think you can handle it? Who do you take me for? Of course I can! Or my name is not Gungan Softbelly with countless wrinkles. What kind of surname is that? The only problem is that to craft a rune worthy of such a weapon, I need a lot of fine crystals from the Valley of Letia. Let me guess. The destroyers control them, and I need to make a clean sweep. Don't worry. Leave it to me. <laughs> I like your spirit, youngling. Wheel. Fate. Turning. Winds. Change. I don't want to sound paranoid, but I think that there's a creepy old guy trying to spy on us. He's one of the Makalot. They are nomads who travel around to spread their wisdom and their ancient knowledge of the planet. No. Chosen. Awful omen. People listen to entire stories from them? <laughs> I would fall asleep in five seconds at that speed. What are you waiting for, lad? Bring me the crystals. We have no time to waste. Oh, right. On my way.
but you are far from completely shining. It will happen again. Basketball mascot on steroids. That is a hybrid, my dear Admiral. To beat this abomination, you'll need to use both your physical and mental skills. should be able to gather these crystals easily. Looks like one of them managed to flee with some of them during the brawl. Wait, I think I already saw that little guy at the village. Maybe it's just me, but it felt like he didn't want to fight. Whatever, let's finish this work and go back to the village. Hey, Abe, once I'm out of here, you'll let me try your sword, right? You wish. So my weapons can be upgraded with root. Huh? That sounds pretty cool. Yes, they contain memories from powerful warriors who left their legacy even after death. They are amplifiers for the amulets we gave you. That's why it feels natural to fight, even if I never did it before. Yes, and some of your latent powers are still dormant. <sighs> Thank <laughs> you. 
have more pressing things at hand. Oh, I really hope that these crystals will be enough to defeat that stupid windbag. See what you've got, Gon Gon of the Fluffy Belly. It's Gang Gang Soft Belly with. Pff, just give them to me. Do you think we could spare some of them for our warriors? We could use them to forge weapons for our allies. Yeah, but the final rune will be inferior, and we don't have time to gather more crystals. Well. I'm sorry. But I will need every inch of power against that monster. Never mind. Giving you more power is all that matters. Good choice, Chosen One. This will lead us closer to our final goal. Okay, now that we're all set, I'll need some time to forge the rune. Come back later and you'll marvel at my art. Great. What should we do in the meantime? Why don't we visit the market? Maybe you'll find something useful for your mission. Sorry, Mila. I guess you'll have to wait a little bit more. No, Biggie. No, I'm not in a hurry. Buy me a coffin while you're at it. You're such a drama queen. Hmm. Now that the market is finally open, I can make some of our delicious recipes. Somehow, I lost my sense of hunger since I got here. But I wouldn't mind a pizza. What's a biba? It's made with wheat, tomatoes, cheese, and... Oh, right! Of course! Delicious! You do realize that she probably doesn't know what you're talking about, right? Oh, so you, you like it too! We'll make one together one day then! Biba for everyone! Yay! I can't wait! like our market, friend? Sure. There are lots of cool things around here. Do you think that the bridge will be fixed soon? Dad is working on it with Thothra. It will be ready soon. Oh, I just had an idea. An idea? I hope it's nothing dangerous. Sorry, friend. I have to go. I'll explain later. Take your time. We'll meet at Gung Gun's shop. Oh, okay. See you there. What's up with her all of a sudden? Again? Seriously? Don't you have anything better to do? Clear. Vision. Important. Follow. 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 Sorry, I don't mean to sound disrespectful, but... Idiot. Follow. Me. Huh? Stupid. Brat. Dumb. Dumb, dumb. Okay, this is enough. Stop right there, damn stalker!
That old fella is starting to get on my nerves. Do you guys think he works for Izanak? <laughs> guys? Can you hear me? Mila? Sun? Moon? Anyone? Space. Time. Collapse. Follow me. If you're leading me to a trap, I swear that... Merge, Dakira. Merge with this rock? You mean, touch it, right? Stupid, stupid, stupid. You want me to merge with a rock? Fine, look. Happy now? Hmm. toward another form of life that I just created. Oh, what a pity. Where am I? Are you a friend of that stalker? Oh, no, you silly. That was just one of my countless forms. Sorry, old hag with a strange hat, but I don't have time for this. What? Ah! What did you say about my hat? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Please don't eat me. Eat you? <laughs> nah. Even though you offended my precious garment, you're right about the old hag part. <laughs> Kids don't know how to have fun anymore. Are you for real? Have some respect, you little brat. I'm Batora, the most powerful being in the universe. Right. And why does the most powerful being in the universe want to help me? Because I'm bored. Any other questions? Uh, just bring me back to that Dahakira. Sure thing, darling. If you find any other trees during your field trip, just touch them and you'll come back to me in a second. Come back soon. Next time, I'll make some tea. Finally, I'm back on Grisha. This planet is becoming weirder and weirder. Is everything all right, child? Yeah, it looks like you spaced out for a second after you touched that thing. What? I was teleported somewhere. Don't tell me that you didn't notice. What are you talking about? I'm talking about Anna. She's supposedly the most powerful being in the universe. I mean, you were here with me too, right? You were right here with us the whole time. What was that name again? The old hag with the strange hat? Come on, I'm not crazy. I swear, it was real. Abe, why are you mumbling? Just tell us her name. Ugh, whatever. Let's get back to Gangan. I think the rune should be ready now. Is she? No, it can't be. 